I mean, how would life be without animals, right? I mean, they come to you just like little birdies and sit on your shoulder. They're not sure what to do. They're looking around for help and they're asking. And he just wants to choose, you know? So I don't even have, I know he won't leave me because my animals, they go, yesterday I had one up here, one on that shoulder, one on this shoulder. <clears throat> I've had about 40 to 50 cats in the last uh, four or five years. And this is the first set. The more powerful I feel inside of the system, okay, of Christ. You see, when you take that little thing in the church, that at T, it's an energy. It's a, re it's a reminder of the energy. It's sort of like a little empty inside. It's a reminder of all the cores and connections of the apples and everything else. And it's an energy. And these guys, okay, this cat is gray. Well, because in his last life, it had something to do like that. I just want to add one thing on now. I am getting off. I just went to the cemetery yesterday, and I look at all the tombstones. The tombstones, most of them, are gray. That means the story who got buried is black. Christ, the creation of the seed that returned to the sky, was white. And in between, left the gray stone, because it was the gray stone, okay, that brought you into life. It was the flint stone that started up the fire. And the characters that are in life are all in us. Whatever we design, it comes from us and goes from us. And we're going to stop it here, but you see, you can't see the cat, right? But her back legs are like bunny rabbit's legs. Because the rabbit and the cat, okay, are communication. The tortoise, okay, is inside the lake. You see, I know she wants to go down, so I'm going to lean back, okay, because the power, okay, and I just did a design on this, and I don't know where the image is. And what happens is the rain goes this way, and the rain goes this way. The sleep and the snow, and the reason for that, sleep and snow on these angles, because these are connecting angles, okay? It connects. Connect, connect, connect. And you have to look at my last video to figure out the little element that was missing in this video because there's a lot in here, right? I'm not pressuring it. At night, there's a more of a flow. During the day, I do a little bit of ups and downs and what this is and what that could be and what this might be and maybe this should be, but it couldn't be. And what if it was? And if you ask me a question, I can say, I don't know. It could be. What do you think? You think I know. He thinks I think. It's almost like saying who's on first. Well, heaven's on first. Oh, heaven's on first. Okay, where am I? Well, you're at home plate. You're in Urantia right now. You're on, you're on an island. And you haven't even left. You haven't made it to third base yet. Because it's not until you make it to third base and come home that you go back to the dugout and start life again. You start your life in the dugout. Okay? You go all around, the way around the bases in life. And at the end, you go back to the dugout. You score a point. Now, in baseball, you have to actually touch each base and be in order and play the game the way it goes, okay? But it's just a resemblance to explain that it's all in the game. And you have to go all the way around the bases in order to connect, which means to accept, okay, that we are real, to accept that this is not what we really look like. We are all energies, okay, and there's nothing we can do about it. So we choose a body the energy would like to live in. The energy is you. You shape, okay, your own energy, okay? You take with you the energy wherever you go because it's the freedom of the choice. When the freedom of the choice is taken away, it's, it's, like, it's like your toilet blocked up. If you can't speak or you have no one to speak to, we are made, okay, we're elements of connections. We're made to connect. If we don't connect, we feel terrible. And bossing around and all this is an authoritative uh, for placing things in order because the energy always gets out of a hand because not everybody's got hands. So it gets out of hand. Whoop. Picture is falling on my back. I didn't even think I'd do this long video. Um, you see this? Okay, now, is this orange one? You see, now this orange one is over the other one, right? And the blue is over the blue. And I only made half a turn, okay? Because the difference between all turns, right? You're not going anywhere on this. Once it comes off of here, you're forced to go over this and down. You're forced. Otherwise, you're walking this way, and it's no longer the same street. You see? See the way the street's going this angle? You might think it's the same street, right? It's not.
Um, we're going to have to stop. I did this video because I had a vision and I cannot see it because it must be precise. It must be the element. You see, one of the elements comes right here. This is the card. One, two X's, and then a piece of X because you're leaving the world, and then a little piece of the X on the other side. The yellow energy is right here. Let me see. See the yellow energy? Why it's like this? Okay. Because they touch. It touches. It's a filament. It touches. And every time you move, it touches. It doesn't matter which way you move. So every time you move, it touches. And every touch is a different sound. Just like the piano, because of the different position you're in, the different way you're thinking. It's all in the touch, my friends. Touchy feely the way it is. What's that all about? The mustache, okay. I'm okay, not sorry. <laughs> no, no, no. If I do something, I want to spend 20 minutes. I don't want to.